Alrighty, good morning campers. This is Tim of Iron Earth 701. Back for another adventure. We're here at uh, Chipmunk 1. Had to take the kayak apart to uh, get some stuff out of it last night. I'm using the uh, bulkheads for a little bit of storage. I think I'm going to change that and only, only use the rear for a storage, but I had to last night. Anyway, can I walk you guys in the site of this? is Chipmunk. It's the only uh, solo site on uh, Crooked Lake here in the Sylvania Wilderness area. So this is going to be a nice long adventure for me. Hopefully uh, going to end better than the one did last time where I got rained out pretty bad <laughs> two years ago. I guess it was just before the beginning of the, beginning of the pandemic. It was, the, it was uh, the summer of 2019. Back here the summer of 2021. Uh, it's got some really nice <coughs> uh, camp furniture somebody built for it. So I really, really like that about it. The one thing I don't like is it, the way the position of the site. You got a southerly wind. You can see how the waves kind of coming into the shore. All the crap kind of collects against the shore here, so it's really hard to get good water. So, and then also was a little bit for the, bug, the bugs last night. But really nice camp furniture, really well kept, uh, well maintained fire pit. Set up blue tarp, like I always do. Still using the Lanshan One. But one thing on this trip, I don't know if I've ever talked about these. I think I used these uh, last year, but I don't think I talked about them. These are um, mosquito coil holders. So you put a mosquito coil in there. And then the mosquito coil will burn, and you can kind of hang them. Uh, the bugs were so bad last night. I, I hung both of them last night to give myself the ability to uh, give, give me a, a little refuge from all the all the bugs. But that uh, really helped me last night. Using butane on this on this uh, using the butane butane stove like I normally do on uh, kayaking trips. So this site is. Um, it's not a bad site. I just the uh, the bugs here are kind of bad because of the uh, all the all the uh, you're kind of inland. There's not really good wind because you're not on a peninsula, and because of the way the wind's blowing, the southerly winds kind of collect debris against the shore, so it's kind of hard to get good water. But the site overall is is it's nice, but it is the only solo site on Crooked Lake, so uh, this is why I picked it. Just trying to dry off some uh, some footwear. We'll see if, if I get any of that drying <laughs> action done before uh, before I go. I normally don't. It normally just stays wet the whole time. But all right, I thought I'd give you guys just an overview of uh, this trip. Um, I'll, I'll I'll go through the trip on a map here. <clears throat> Maybe when I get to uh, Coyote on uh, I think that's East Mountain, East Bear Lake. That's right, East Bear Lake. And I'll go through the go through the trip in, in more detail, and uh, gonna cook some fancy stuff on this trip as well. I'll show that I'll show that as well. I'm gonna try making some fry bread in the back country. We'll see how that goes. Alrighty, well I'm gonna get going here and uh, get myself some breakfast, and then we'll, uh, we'll go from there. All right, see you guys in the water. Bye bye. 